Surprise, surprise. Look who's here. <laughs> I told you she wasn't coming, and she did. I did, <laughs> yeah. She's got goodies to show you. Not many. No, but she has got goodies, but which I've, I've not got. got. Goodies. Yes. I'm sat here in all my tap because I've been cleaning. And I've just realised, I thought, flippy neck, it's typical me. I've still got ends to oh. sew in. <laughs> if you knew how many people on the video <coughs> say, oh, look, <coughs> good, cough up a break. I know. Good grief. Where's the tail end of that? Horrible cold I had. Yeah. And it just, it's getting better slowly. Mm. So all of you who've asked, she's getting better slowly. Yeah. And if anybody well, wants to know, it, I'm... I'm in agony. <laughs> but it's my own fault because I've been cleaning. <laughs> right, so, Laura. The shawl. The shawl, Laura. The shawl. Let me get it right, Rose. What's she called? The crochet hoovian. Yeah. Yeah. There we are. Oh. Slightly... I, I put, see, put dangles. Dangles. I put dangles on the end and I've forgotten to weave the... Yeah, she's put dangles. Yeah. Well, let's hold it to the way. Yeah. I think it's stuck in it. <laughs> but it's come out really nice. Yes. Yeah, look at that. That's nice, isn't it? Yeah. There's a few more repeats than on the pattern because I was using our double knitting way. Yeah, which one. is finer yarn than... Um, finer yarn than the worsted it called for. Yeah. But I can really see it in a four ply or a sock yarn yeah. on a big oak. Yeah. And it'll be lovely. I mean it, it it's got a lovely drape to it. <laughs> what are you like? I'm in the ass back. <laughs> but I'm all. really, really chuffed with it. Yeah. That's very nice. I've got the pattern. But it's lovely, so thank you Laura, ever so much. Tell everybody what it's called. Valeriana by, by Nancy it, by the Drew. Not the one who writes books or has stories written about her or yeah. whatever. But it's but a paid for uh, pattern, ladies. It is. Um, I think it's via Willow Yarns. But I had no success whatsoever with Willow Yarns and their policies on selling patterns. Oh, God, the number of times I've done that and they say, what's your... You, you zip code and that, and you put That's our postcode it. in, and it goes, Sorry, we don't sell anything. Yeah, but I even got to, you know, um, a sort of like overseas bit. Yeah. And it still wouldn't have it. Uh, and then the, when they're sending it, yeah, and it's like a PDF, isn't it? So yeah. why wouldn't they send it? It's happened to but, me quite um, a few times, yeah. I, I emailed them. Now, I've emailed them about five, six times. Because I was on a roll, you know, yeah. I want this pattern and I want it now. Yeah. Um, and I'm wondering if they've just got their email set up mm. so that they only take, you know, American, e you know, yeah. IP addresses or something like that. Yeah, no, because Laura had no trouble. She just told no, me. No, well, can't. that's it. I mean, it's happened to me with Tacky Stacey Charles. And yeah. All. And is it Webbs as well that... Webs, I think, do it now, but they didn't at first. They well, didn't I know our, um, on Ravelry, oh, it's going back a couple of years, but there was a Canadian lady who was having a problem yeah. with an American, yeah. you know, supplier sort of thing. And mm. I know a lot of our UK ones don't send abroad, um, but I think they do if it's a PDF. Oh, yeah. I think they just don't send a hard copy. Yeah. Because it costs so much for the... Well, that's it. It's the postage and everything. But, you know, when it's an e-pattern, yeah. a download, you would expect to be able to get it from yeah. anywhere in the world. I know when Tacky Stacey Charles did one, it was at Irish Channel, and I finished up paying £16 yeah. for, this, for this damn pattern. Because, I mean, it was a nice pattern. <laughs> I think you did one out of it, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Yeah. People, sorry, people, I wasn't comfy. <laughs> well, no, I've sent away for. I think it. There was a couple of patterns. But again, it was a Doris Chan because yeah. I thought, oh, I'll order two while I'm. I'll yeah. think because I got you one, didn't yeah. I? Um, but. You know, if they're downloadable. Yeah. I mean, I've got, of a button. I've got a few downloadables of Doris Chan and they do seem rather expensive. But when oh, they come, come on. No, there's 30, every penny. 32 pages of lots of descriptions for every size. Yeah. She doesn't have work for well, the money, it. that girl, doesn't that's she? That's it, but there's, 
you know, the pattern as written. Yeah. And then you've got charts to back it up and then photos. you've got all the yeah. It, I must does, admit yeah. the blowing of value for money. Yeah. They really are. I mean, people have said to me, where, where are you? Oh, I'm not paying that for it. I said, well, I'm sorry, but I had to, you know. Well, I <laughs> That's the way it is, isn't years it? Years ago, um, maybe three or four years ago, and um, I paid for this pattern. All right. <laughs> where am I going? <laughs> it, it wasn't a vast amount of money. Yeah. But the pattern I got back, I couldn't believe it. Yeah. It was, you know, chain so, so many to start and then yeah. increase or do your foundation wrong and then increase evenly across the row. Yeah. Have you ever... You know, like 26 stitches and you thought, well, hang on a minute. Yeah. Have you ever You'd want those? it. Yeah. Some people would want that breaking down. I mean, the Russian ones are best. Whatever they are, Ukrainian, whatever. You buy them off Etsy and you get one sheet, don't you? And it's just... It's a diagram. <laughs> Doesn't tell you how many you've got to work out, how many to cast on and everything. And you've paid like about a fiver for this thing. Yeah. You? And you're thinking, huh? I mean, yeah, you can understand why Doris Chow ch charges about yeah. 12 quid when you get 33 pages with detailed instructions. But when you buy these translated loosely from the, the thing Russian, is, you are never quite sure what you're going to get, are you? No, you never. No, you when know. it says a PDF, you don't know whether you're going to get one page. Or, or ten on, pages. Or ten pages. Yep. And some of them, I mean, I know I'm fairly experienced in crocheting, but some of them I can't make any tape. No. I mean, you with those Japanese, I don't know how you manage them. I can't But do as long Japanese. as I've got a starting chain, yeah. I can generally figure it out. Yeah. I'm all right with the French ones, but I do speak a, yeah. a very, very smidgy bit of French, but I can work out most of it, you know. Yeah. But, uh ooh. I mean, I love that, what she called, La uh, Laura Sapino, what she called. Yes. Her video, some of the things she does are oh, lovely. Oh, God, they're amazing, but, aren't they? But she, she's, she's Portuguese or Mexican or something. But she talks a dime a dozen. She's... And when you click on translate, you don't get anything. It no. Doesn't, she doesn't translate, does she? I wish she would. I mean, you're trying to no, watch she her. she some love You're trying to watch her and she's going, what do you want? I do I'm literally... You're thinking, hang on a minute, she, and I'm trying to count with her like when she's grocery in the chain. Freeze frame. Freeze frame. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I give up So me. anyway, Laura, thank you ever so much. Yeah. It's going to be good. Yeah. Because I thought I can even scrunch it up. This is what made me think. Yeah. Stop your um, four ply, scrunch yeah. it up and... Yeah, I love the ones with the tails down the front, like, you know. Yeah. Very sort of... Um, Gypsies, cowboyish, whatever you want to yeah. call it. Yeah, yeah. But the poncho is coming along. Yeah. I've decided it's long enough. And the bugger of it is, I'm going to have to start a new ball what, to, to do the it? edges. Mm. But if I want to put fringe on it, You'd have to it's going to be. You've got to have another ball. Yeah. But like I say, it's sort of like, oh, when do you stop with the poncho? I think it's very. It's a personal mm. thing. Yeah, it isn't, isn't it? it? If you want it like down to your knees, <laughs> I don't want it down to my knees. Yeah. But I think it's, you know, yeah. of a of a length now. Yeah. Well Yeah. No mirror. Can't see what it's doing. <laughs> but I think it's of a length now that it's You see if I had one of those round. cameras like a lot of people have where the screen turns around. So you can see what's Jam. Get a new camera. Oh yeah, right. yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> My credit card bill's just coming on hiding. <laughs> so I have to get another. All one. I have to do is go do the edging. Yeah. Which hopefully, she says, might get done for next time. <laughs> I can't with have it. so many things on the go. I mean, I'm lucky, really. I'm glad because I've only got one thing on the go because I can't really do much yeah. at the moment. But. It would hurt me even more if I had about six things on the go. <laughs> oh, I'm the terrible. only person that I know who only does one thing at yeah. once. Yeah. I never did when I was younger. Maybe it's an old age thing. <laughs> well, no, I watched, watched Laura Crochet Hoovian. Yeah. Uh, one of her YouTube videos. Yeah. And she has all these bags. Oh, yeah. I couldn't be that neat. She's got... With me, it's sort of like something gets... 
put in a, a, a carrier bag, then it gets stuffed in another bag yeah. with some other stuff. And I've got. I wish I could be that. I've got a few uh, project bags, but you know I always forget to use them. I wish I could be that organised. I'm not. Mine's stuffed in a. Because <coughs> uh, I keep saying I'm bag. going to get some th things that sort of like you can put on your work. Yeah. And it says four and a half or five yeah, or five yeah. and a half or six. So you know. So you know which hook and then I don't have to leave the hook in. Yeah. And then think, flipping out where have all my crochet hooks gone? Because <laughs> that's, no, I'm that's quite, a favourite. Uh, the most I had on the go when I was bad with my arms was two things. See, number five hook. Yep. <laughs> was in here. And you were looking for it, were you? I day? was looking for it till, till the week. Some hooks vanish like the wind, don't they? Yeah. With me, it's usually a 5 or a 5.50, because that's what I tend to use the most. Uh, yeah. Although I do use a 4, 4.50 for some things, yeah. Do you know, I was looking for a, a number 4. Mm. Um, when was it? Not yesterday, the day before. Uh -huh. um, I found... <laughs> Half started, I won't even say half finished. A half started item that I thought, oh, I'll carry on with that. Yeah, and I thought it must have been on the four and a half. It looked four and a yeah. half anyway. After doing a few stitches on four and a half, I thought, no, it's not a four and a half, it's a four, <laughs> must be a four. Could I can I find a four? Mm. And I know I've got loads, uh, they're the ones I was breaking for, right. They must just be that. They're just a bit. I must put too much pressure on them. Yeah. Like, where the where the thumb plate is, they were snapping yeah. off there. All right. I've never had that. That mind you, I do prefer metal hooks. You uh, say. Yeah. So. Well, I do crush a lot of the plastic ones, but uh, yeah. But mm, I'm, I'm a demon. I must warm them. You know. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm like Yuri. Yuri Geller with goes, spoons. <laughs> I, I must admit, though, I've broken um, a metal one. Right. And also, I've ruined a metal one by dropping it when I've been outside. And it's fallen on the concrete yeah. flags, you know, the, the paving stones. And it's just scored the top of the... always seems to fall on its head. Yeah. But then when it gets, it gets a rough bit. I mean, I've tried filing it with yeah. memory boards and all sorts, but no, once it's been roughed up... That's it. I know I've won up as well, like that. You might as well just chuck it, yeah. And it's sort of... Why does it keep snagging and then you think, oh, it's that hook. And yeah. I can't bear to chuck it out, I it's just not I don't like right. using big hooks, I don't know what there is about big hooks, I don't like using them. Where well, is my hands? I'll tell you what ladies, while I've not been crocheting, my hands have now been stiff. Yeah. You know, I think the daily crocheting must keep them supple. Yeah. But they've been aching and yeah. really sore. I don't know why we're doing that. And the other day they were puffed up all across the top here. Arthritis, old age. <laughs> I was just telling Sue something before and she said, is this what I've got to look forward to? <laughs> yeah. Yes. 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 That's it. I'm, I've been warned. I shan't say I'm prepared. I've been warned. No. Well, I used to look at my mum and think, why is she walking like that? Stooped yeah. Stooped up. Well, there's <coughs> times when, you know, you just catch sight of yourself. Yeah. And it's sort of like, you look at, you know, I looked at my hands for some reason or other. Yeah. And I thought, Oh, grandma's fingers. Yeah. Oh, lady and her fingers were yeah. a minor beginning to go. No, my saggy skin, you know, old lady's hands. <laughs> they pinch it, don't they, to see how di 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 dehydrated you are. Yeah. See, mine's just about gone down now, so I must be quite hydrated today. Oh, you see, yours didn't even stay up. I'm hydrated, but look at state of hands, they're as dry as anything. Yeah. But I must admit that corn huskers yeah, stuff. Yes, I've still got it over there. Ain't it good? Yeah. I have to keep it out of range when the children are around because they might think it's lemonade. I <laughs> <laughs> know it's good stuff. Yeah. Oh, there I am wearing my old tat today. So you have to excuse me, no jewellery. When you clean it and it's clanking about. On oh, your God. Chest. It's not, not ideal, is it? You know. It's not, but hey ho. Well, my family are coming tomorrow. Hey ho, oh, my two little fluffy girls are coming. Yeah, hey, I have missed them. Poppy and Sky. Poppy and Sky, yeah. I must admit they are good dogs, aren't yeah. they? They're lovely dogs. They're my furry grandchildren, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Although Poppy's not been so good, she's getting old a bit now, so. I just hope I she's know. okay when she comes, yeah. That's just it. They're on the long way now. They're on, I think they're probably on the ferry now, I think. 
Probably. I know when Sue rang me, I thought, oh my God, don't tell me they're earlier. <laughs> My stash room's not been done, it's half on the land, isn't it? It is. <laughs> it is. But I've moved some of it for you. <laughs> now, my hip went after I've been doing the garage. I mean, it was a stupid thing to do, lugging them big totes about, you know. Mm, yeah. Like super bad. But um, the girls go in there when they've been for a walk because they like jumping in the river, you see. And they come back wet and muddy. and That's it, yeah. So they put them in the garage till they dry out, you know. Yeah. Because <laughs> my garage goes through and then through part of the kitchen, and then there's a back door, so they can go straight through and into the garden. Yeah, have a good shake. And have a good shake and a dry out, you see. So they have that run through there. So uh, we have a baby gate. <laughs> no babies in sight, but we have a baby gate to keep them from coming in the house when they're wet and drippy. Because they do love to jump all over you when they're wet and mucky and drippy. Oh, they always do, don't mm. they? Mm. I know my daughter's dogs do. They're sort of like, no! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, when I had Buster, he used to come back filthy. I don't know where he used to find to walk through, but by go, I mean... I know, but if there's a patch of mud in the desert, they'd, uh, they'd find it, <laughs> wouldn't they? <laughs> hey, I do miss my Buster. Hey, and I haven't had Gigi all week either, because sadly Richard's mum um, died, and so Gigi's been at home with his daddy, um, consoling him. It's probably a good thing, actually, because when yeah. the girls come, he'll not be here tomorrow. Yeah. You know, so when he does come, he'll come into them, won't he? That's it, yeah. And they'll be accepting of him. He goes territorial, you see, when right. Gigi's here and they come in. Yeah. For the first time. It's a bit awkward, yeah. But if they're already here, he'll be fine, yeah. Oh, God. He'll, I'm sure he'll remember. Oh, gosh, yeah. Because he used to love Poppy to death. He used to curl up because he's little Poppy. Oh. <laughs> like she's cuddly. Shouldn't have favourites, but she's been. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, naughty. Yeah, I really like Sky the best, I think. Yeah. But of the two, she's the more lovey dovey. Sky's only lovey when she wants to. Yeah. You know, she's more go away, I'm on my own. Whereas the minute Poppy sees me, she comes running up to me, you know. Oh, dear lady. <laughs> Message. No, Email it's me. something or other. Summit. Yeah. That that call before yesterday, it was a, um, what do you call it, a nuisance caller. And they've called me twice since then, yeah. So apart from having injections in your back, what have you been up to? Not a right lot. Just, you know, sometimes you just seem to go from day to day. Mm. And all right, you're just getting the basics done, but yeah. you don't seem to have a lot of time for... No, it's like me. I mean, it takes me so long to do the little basic jobs, you know. And you think, when I was younger, I would have ripped through yeah. the house. It would have been spotless yeah. and that. And now I start doing one thing, and I'm like, oh, I'll have to sit down for Mind five minutes. That, you, know? Like I say, you know, I had, I had a spinal injection last week yeah. for pain relief. And, you know, while I know I've got to take it easy yeah. for a week or so, yeah. You know, because then it, you get the best out of it if you don't. Yeah, we start working right yeah. away. You're just. Um, but it's like, oh, that needs doing. That needs doing. Yeah. Oh, I could just. No, you can't. Just stop. Well, I'm sitting here well, and the sunlight is shining all across my carpet, and I'm like, it's dog hair on the carpet. <laughs> <laughs> I can see dog hair on the carpet, and it's annoying me. <laughs> and yet, when I start hoovering, it's like. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> And I can see dust on the glass table, you know, where the telly's stuck on it. Yeah. I love sunshine, but it blasts show me dirty wind. I know. Oh, dear. I know. It shows me dirty wind as it shows me glassware. <laughs> I've got my tickling stick. I've got a big fluffy yeah. duster on a stick. My tickling stick. But it don't work on glass. <laughs> no. It's Especially so, tellies, because like, they get static, don't they? Yeah, they really your dust. It's the same with the down below. The, um, yeah. Yeah the record player, whatever you call it these days, stereo. It does that like that and then two minutes later it's like it's yeah. like magnets. They used to sell anti-static dusters, I don't know whether they still do or not. Probably they probably do. do. They probably do. You probably get them in these Sunday supplement magazines of things you never knew you needed. Yeah, <laughs> like the better wear. <laughs> not whether you've got anything like that. The better wear people used to come and put things through your door. And they sell all these things like yeah. spider traps, don't they? And all sorts of things you didn't know you wanted. Yeah. Yeah. 
grip things to put on your shoes when it's snowing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. All sorts of weird and wonderful stuff. Isn't it? You know. Magnifying glasses. Oh, I'll tell you what I bought. I could have shown. Oh yeah, you. those glasses that I've got lights on. I've got them. I know, they but came those today. glasses you know did. Yeah, I've got a pair. The lens. Look, rubbish. I've got a pair. The lens is flipped down so you can put your makeup on. It's, ru that eye it's while rubbish you're because when you've only got one good eye like I've got, oh, it's great for, you know, when you're looking through this eye and you're doing this eye. But when I do that and try to do this eye, I can't see a thing. <laughs> but I've just bought a new pair of glasses. Does, uh, yeah, we like some. We like some, oh. yeah. I haven't tried them tonight. Those um, slipper things. Oh, what are you putting? We put both feet in one thing. <laughs> that reminds me of Billy oh, Connolly. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> then you think you're a, a kangaroo when you have to go and make a brew yeah, boy. boy. <laughs> I've got slipper socks. You don't really. I've <laughs> got slipper socks that you put in the microwave. Yeah. They warm up, but they've got beads in them. So it's the same when you get up to walk anywhere, you're like sliding about on these oh, beads. Oh, flipping heck. You have to take them off because you can't walk in them. Do you know what? My feet are like cow-eyed at the <laughs> bottom. But I tell you what, if I get anything in my shoe or <laughs> there's anything on carpet, don't I feel it? I can't wear crochet socks for that reason. Right. Because they're like ridges. Yeah. I can feel every ridge underneath my foot. But, you know, the pad bit isn't sensitive and the heel bit isn't sensitive. But you know the bit in between yeah. the instep? Ooh. Even when I put knitted socks on, I have to turn them inside out. And where, you know, the knit side yeah. to All be right. foot. And the pearl side has to come outside. So, yeah, have you ever seen me? I wear my socks inside out. <laughs> Although Jenny sent me some fluffy ones. Um, they're nice because they're not too tight. Yeah. I usually get like tight marks where the elastic goes around my ankles. Yeah. And I think they must be stopping the circulation in my feet. <laughs> well, we've got two minutes and 47 seconds before we have to go off. Right on. We haven't discussed much crochet today, have we? But never mind. <laughs> well, we've seen two, you know. Yeah. 99.9% finished and 95% finished. And I haven't items. done anything because I've been that busy trying to clean <coughs> up. And the accent is on the trying. You've tried. I've tried to clean up. And God loves a trier. <laughs> and boy, is she trying. I am. Yeah, I'm very trying. <laughs> I'm sort of looking forward to my family coming tomorrow, but in the same me. The, the, the I'm same, thinking, yeah, of dread. Oh, there's a dread they're going to find finger marks they're going to find dirty whatever <sighs> I have well, to clean you, up. But just remember one thing this is your home I know but I don't like to be I'm proud I like to, to look nice yeah. are we still on? oh yeah we are <laughs> <laughs> I think we better say goodbye before we get shut off because we've got 1 minute 47 seconds left right oh <laughs> so thank you for being with us yeah so I hope to see you soon yeah so it's like the two rollies, isn't it? Goodbye from you, goodbye from you. <laughs> I know. Hey, don't say that. They've both gone. Oh, they, no. Now? Poor Ronnie Corbett died. Yeah. Too. Everybody's down here. I'm getting worried. <laughs> no, apparently there were four candles on the altar. Oh, yeah. As a tribute to... Just, are you in America? If you understand a sort of Cockney accent, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. Just Google four candles. Yeah. And when the two Ronnies come up, yeah, it's watch it. You might not get the oh. humour, but we do. <laughs> yeah, the classic, in, absolute his, classic. On his hearse, there was a pair of his big glasses, wasn't there? Because yeah. he used to do that with his glasses, and um, the four candles. <laughs> anyway, Bless. after we bamboozled you, now we're going to go. Yeah, now. yeah. So bye. Thank you all for watching.